2K Sports and the Corn Ferry Tour are delighted to welcome you to today's event. Today's coverage of the Kelly Classic is set to kick off. Luke Eldy alongside Rich Beam, as always, in the booth. Pleasure of being here at Echo Park Golf Club. Rich, what are these players facing as they step up to this first tee? Well, it's a really cool opening tee shot with the city views in the background. However, don't get lulled to sleep because you got to hit a good tee shot to avoid all four bunkers that dot this fairway, both right and left. Second shot slightly uphill to, again, a green that's well protected by bunkers, both right and left. An opening par here is a fantastic score. Looking forward to this, Rich. Let's get into the action. That one's right out of the top drawer. And Henny, what kind of a shot are they facing this time? Setting up here from about 190 yards. Opting for the five iron. Well, they'd love a little bounce to the right here. Yeah, that was a safe play. 18 feet to the cup. He's on a good line. He's got a par part here. Let's see if he can make it. And that's an opening hole par for this player. That's a rock solid par right there. He's currently tied for 13. Looking at a par five here. Oh, well done. One win so far this season. Looking for number two here today. Getting ready to play their third. Oh, well played. All right, Henny. What's he got in front of him here with this putt? This one's 13 feet from the cup. It's got a chance. Ooh. Cutting for a par here. Down she goes. Let's head to the next. Here we are at the third. What kind of shot are they facing here, Henny? And from about 105 yards.
Oh, this is on a fantastic line. Is it the right distance? Oh, standing ovation after that shot. Nearly doesn't get any better than that. Amazing shot. Oh, good look at birdie here. And well hold. Let's move on. Currently one under for the event. Gotta like it. Moving up the leaderboard. Never a bad thing. Here we are at Echo Park Golf Club, the fourth hole, and it's a big brute of a par four. Off the tee, your eyes look down the left-hand side and see two massive bunkers and obviously the water, so anything right of that is just fine. If you find the fairway, second shot is downhill just a little bit to a long, narrow green that has got bunkers down the right-hand side. Distance control with that second shot is absolutely imperative if they want to have a good look at birdie. This shot coming from around the 150-yard marker. Only two shots off the pace. Going with the 9-9, I think. Playing within their comfort zone there. And this putt to move into second spot on the leaderboard, or at least a share of it. Gets that one to go down, and that's back-to-back -back birdies. To the top five he goes. Just one off the lead after that hole. And after a birdie at the last, you take the honour on the hole. <laughs> Going with the seven. Oh, wonderful shot and a chance for birdie at the fifth nine feet to the cup it's on a good line oh what a super shot and that will take him to three under Well, good move there. Anything north on the leaderboard's always pleasant. This is a short par four, always a fun hole to play. Standing on this par four and leading. What's the strategy? What's going on through their mind? Attack it or lay back? Yeah, you hit a beauty, didn't you? Time for the second shot here at the sixth. Great ball striking. It's a thing of beauty. Trying to get it to four under with this putt. This one's tracking. Oh, so close. It's just about three feet away. This for par. 
Yeah, well hold. Let's move on to the next. Currently at three under for the day. This hole is a par five. Well, this should find the short grass. Second shot here on the seventh. And the effort, that one. And here we are with the third shot. He's currently tied for the lead. And Henny, what are they looking at here? Just got to trickle this one in the front door. It's downhill. This is a good chance. Nice one. Fourth booty of the day. And with that, he'll move to four under par. And just keeping it in neutral on the leaderboard. Let's see what happens here at the eighth. This would be a great up and down. And he needs this to save par. I don't mind the look of this. For the par. Finds himself in a share of the lead. Time now to begin the ninth hole, Rich. Well, I hope you pack the bucket and spade because you're heading to the sand. Playing now from the fairway bunker. And from the bunker here, looking for an up and down. And this putt coming up for his par. Yeah. 
Business has eyes for the hole. How good would that have been if it had dropped? Our current leader is enjoying a two-stroke lead. As we head now to the par five next. Awesome stuff. Time for the second shot at the 10th. Disappointing that one. Getting ready to play their third. Just two shots behind. Oh, what a wonderful bunker shot. Well, what a way to bounce back. Nice putt to hold. And that will take him to four under. He's currently in the second position. Getting closer to that top spot on the leaderboard. This is getting interesting. And this shot from about 150 yards out. Only one shot off the pace. Choosing the 9-iron nine -nine here. A tidy looking shot, that one. Outstanding shot, high quality. Seven feet to the cup. Looking for another birdie here. Looks good. Fair effort, that. Good birdie. Back to back birdies moving the right direction there, Luke. Our current leader is enjoying a one shot lead. Teeing off here on the 12th hole. <laughs> Going with the eight iron here. Now, yeah, good safe shot, this one. That should find the surface. A wonderful shot and a birdie opportunity coming up at the 12. And mark it down. That's birdie number seven on the scorecard. And that will take him to six under. And that makes him tied for first. Well, the 13th hole here at Echo Park Golf Club uh, is not as kind. A big hole at 504 from the tips. Well, thankfully, it's slightly downhill off the tee. But yes, avoid those bunkers down the right hand side. And of course, that meandering brook that is a feature of this golf course. Big hitters can actually take it over everything down the right hand side. But that's for the brave few. Second shot downhill slightly to a massive green. Just some big bunkers on the left hand side, but plenty of bailout room over to the right. Uh, great shot. Second shot here on the 13th. The 
looks like they've got the five wood. <laughs> Nicely done. Scorecard filled with threes never hurts. Good putt to make this. Oh, what a shame. That would have been a nice one to hole. Just a four-footer remaining. Nice little par putt here. That's well holed. So no change on the leaderboard for this player after that hole. This hole is a par four. Trying to work a little draw into this flag. Sitting at six under for the day. Currently tied for first place. Opting for the nine iron. Well, this one's right at the pin. Outstanding approach shot. This one's for Birdie. Not their best stroke. Seemed to have pulled that one. Right on four feet. Should make this one. Well, it was a wonderful approach shot, wasn't it? But unfortunately having to settle for par. Currently six under for the round. We've arrived at a par four hole. And after a par at the last, chance to maybe take a step in the right direction here. That dog will hunt. Henny, what's the player facing here? I'd say he's about 165 from this flag. Well, good looking shot here. That's headed towards the green. Terrific shot into the 15th and a chance for birdie. This putt just five feet away from the hole. It's got a chance. And that's eight birdies today. And we're just a slim lead coming down that stretch. Anything can happen. And with that, he's now broken the tie, all alone at the top of the leaderboard. Three holes remaining, folks. Hang on to your hats. This is going to be a wild and woolly finish. Looking to ride the momentum after coming off a birdie here with this shot. Oh, this one's right down the pipe. Well, there's a very good reason why he's leading this tournament, and that's Exhibit A. It has been fantastic to watch all week long. This player is dialed in. Dee's making this look easy. Keeps surging ahead. I don't like it. Two in a row. He's feeling it. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. Two holes to go, Luke. I know who I like. And now we find ourselves with a par four here. <laughs> 
Oh, that's a high caliber shot. Penny, what have they got in front of them here? Setting up here from about 175 yards. Going with the six iron here. Oh, this would be handy if we could bounce right. Good shot there. And a chance to reach nine under for the championship with this putt. And gets that putt of distance to go. Currently three strokes up after that hole. Well, what a lovely position to be in, holding the lead, playing the last. Good luck. Oh, that was pure. Second shot here at the 18th. And here we are with their four. Currently leading by three. What a shot! Almost went in. Oh, Beamer, that's the way to win. Unreal. Is there anything better than a walk-off win? I think not. Moments like that deserve another look. This shot was absolutely perfect. Looks just as nice on the second viewing. Well, that was a thrilling day. And on behalf of myself, Luke Elvey, Rich Beam and all the hard-working folks at 2K Sports, thanks for your company. We look forward to the next time you join us.